Hello guys, this is Linus Lima Yankee to Hotel. I'm on a seaside, sunset's coming, and I'm on the camping ground, and luckily there's a huge field in front of me, totally empty. And today I'm gonna do a quick experiment with my shorty 80 to 10 meters antenna, which is deployed very low on the six meter pole Soda beam six meter pole. The other end of the antenna is maybe just uh, maybe two meters or, or less. So, as you know, this antenna is shortened antenna on 80 meters. Uh, it's a full end fed half wave antenna for 40 to 10 meters. And here there's a coil, loading coil, and few meters of wires after the coil. And this makes this antenna work on 80 to 10 meters on. So the, the loading coil makes antenna look electrically longer and compensates all these bad things like reactances and, and whatever. I'm gonna check with this antenna into our local evening net. I'm only got in my camper van, in my radio van today, Alecraft KX2 radio and this is it just Alecraft KX2 uh, running off uh, campers battery so there everything's on Anderson power poles in my ham radio van so we'll see so I probably will release 10 to 12 watts of output and um, so the um, here's the transformer 49 to 1 transformer made by myantennas.com it's a very good transformer and i like this company even if i have nothing in common with this company i'm just buying buying not not one more than one transformers and using them very very successfully in in low power and even high power applications so this very nice antenna over length is around 23 24 meters there's a separate video on my channel uh, about this antenna about you know how i made it and and how it was performing in the forest so now it's on the seaside and it's gonna perform in a very very nvis configuration so we will see what happens so the signals of other guys around 300 kilometers away from me from me now are quite strong tonight with this on this antenna so and antenna is doing pretty well on the receive at least we will see how it's gonna do on transmit and the sunset is magnificent L Y du Henrikas Portabilos, Leonas Y du Henrikas Portabilos. The net control, having heard me on, on the first attempt, because other stations have been calling him too. Lima Yankee 1 Lima India, the net control gave me 5 9 on my second attempt. He is in the capital city, more than 320 kilometers away from my location on the seaside, and he's been running 100 watts and a very good dipole antenna. The next station in the net was Lima Yankee through Echo. He is some 250 kilometers away. He gave me 5.9 plus 5 dBs, and he's running high power and a big wire antenna on 80 meters. I, I heard him 5.9 plus 20 dB, and I was surprised by the cleanliness of the band on the seaside. No city made QRM at all. Uh. 
This was Lima Yankee 3 Fox India Stroke Portable. He gave me 5.7. I gave him 5.72. He was located some 350 kilometers away from me on the lake shore and he was running 100 watts into a very low hanging wire antenna, as actually was my antenna too. I've made some five more QSOs with other stations in the net and I was reliably copied by all other participants. Actually, I could have needed switch to the JC call mode and send a message or go windling or similar and send an email if it were an emergency situation or any other necessity. All right, guys. So it's very, very good news. Uh, the the my shorty, shorty eight to ten meters antenna is working very, very nicely this uh, this evening on the from the seaside, and uh, it proved that it's uh, not only a good DX antenna on higher bands, but it's a very good NVIS near vertical incident sky wave antenna. Uh, designed for local for local contacts, local nets, and it's very portable, very very quickly deployable. And I I, I thought on the six meter mast, it's, it's not going to be enough, but it's enough. It's enough, and it uh, and it's really working very well. Uh, all the guys uh, in the net been receiving me uh, like five seven five five seven to five nine and uh, all of them were uh, east south from me so i'm on the western western part of the country on the seaside on the baltic seaside baltic coast and uh, all guys were more than 300 kilometers away two well some of them were 250 kilometers away from uh, from my location where i am now so it means uh, in the case of emergency or in the case of uh, some other necessity uh, this antenna uh, called sometimes called Hollandina so for maybe because its origin is in Holland uh, so I call it shorty 80 to 10 ant fed half wave antenna this antenna is very very useful for for any any occasions so that's it for today guys if you are on the seaside get your radio with you qrp is enough make experiments and have fun and so fun but also some you know meaningful exercises and some some discoveries so thanks for watching please leave your comments please share your experience on what are you using in your summer trips or summer outings and very nice to exchange views and news that's it for today peace and victory for ukraine see you in my next videos 73 this is linas lima yankee 2 hotel